everybody, I am Muddy Dragon and welcome back to the Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. So, let's kick things off again. So this is part two, of course. Part one, if you haven't seen part one, go back and have a look at part one. It will let you know what the hell has been going on. Okay, walker right there. Multiple walkers. Ah! Okay, lots of walkers. Okay, over there is where we need to go. Okay, let's go. Oh, shit. Don't look this way. So you can make the game harder by putting on this one setting that enables the uh, other characters in the game as well as the walkers here to hear where you are. That makes the game incredibly difficult. I haven't tried it yet, but I've seen it in action. Okay, the place we're trying to get to is that mansion right there, and it's just around the corner from here. But to get there, it's not easy. There's a lot of stuff to collect around here. And there's a lot of walkers to try and avoid. But there is also other ways of getting in into the building. And we're going to try one of those ways right now. Because I didn't know about this in my other playthrough where I've lost all my audio. I didn't know about getting in that way. I'm going to take care of this guy now. Hello, pal. You. Come on, beautiful. Come on. Now, his birthday. Bye. Okay. Let's have a little look around first. Anything worth picking up? Right, let's go a bit sneaky around here and peek. Okay, there's nothing here. That's good. Nothing here to pick up. It's unfortunate. Right, let's get into this mansion and try and get our mission done. So, there we need to... What are we actually going in there for? There's a lady we met in the first episode. She was asking us to go in there because her husband has turned and she couldn't deal with him and we said we'd do it we would help and deal with him and get the wedding ring off of him as well there you go what 17 out of 27 take some cigarettes okay should be all right yeah where where Just heard it. Heard a walker. What have we got here? What's this? Uh... Oh, food. And yet it's really easy to uh, <laughs> to fill up your inventory with stuff. Now, last time I didn't actually take that. I didn't take the pipe going up. That's going to be a neat little way of getting up there. Well, let's do that now. I want to see. And this will enable us to avoid all the walkers that are in the building on the lower levels. But also means we don't have any bandages. Well, we've got some on us, but there's quite a lot of bandages in... Oh. Energy level is dropping. Okay, let's put that on. Now, I went in through the front door before, and it was easy enough. But then, there was a lot of walkers when I did it. Okay, 
So right now. Swap hands. This is so immersive, it's insane. If you're new here, please consider subscribing to the channel. Smash like and hit that bell to be informed whenever I bring out a new video. I love this game. I really do. Oh, an axe. Awesome. Now, the guy we need to kill to take care of... One minute. I've got Lucille on my back. I forgot about that. I forgot all about Lucille. Right, what we can do, store the axe. Okay, there they are. That's the door we need to go through. Right, that is where the husband is, and we need to get the ring off the husband, we need to kill the husband. And there's also a part for the radio in this building. That's the main reason why we're actually in. There's none down there, but they're all around there. Shit. Okay, back up a bit. Quick. Up here is the husband. Let's go deal with him. If I didn't mention already, there is a setting. <sighs> hey, man, I'm here for you. <laughs> there we go. You can rest in peace now. Well, there's the ring that we need from him. My Journal dearest piece. Corinne, I lied to you. The I room. am sorry. I had to spare you. A lost hope. Our children died by my hand. I had to set them free to protect them from a fate worse than death. I know you will never be able to forgive me. Huh, but time. maybe one day you will understand that I had no choice. They did not suffer. Take comfort in that, my love. Ruben. I think she can take any comfort in knowing that, my pal. Hmm, I think I will leave. One of the locks. Actually, let's see what this turns into. Is this turning into anything or does it not turn into anything? Special, one of a nine-piece commemorative set can't be scrapped. Oh my goodness. I had no idea. So it's got to be one for every level. There must be. My goodness. And you, my friend, loaded already. Can't put it there. Damn it. Well, we got ourselves a shotgun. It's a beauty. It's a beauty. But we don't have ammo for it. Take the shotgun. Okay. We got our revolver, we got a shotgun, we got Lucille, we got an axe. What we're gonna do? We're gonna get the hell out of here. Okay, it's beeping away. It means it's getting late and yeah, there'll be more and more walkers out there as it gets later, and then when the alarm goes off, when well, the beep, the uh, bells go, that's when it's going to get a bit more dangerous. Ammo? Pistol ammo. That's useful, of course. Yeah, I can't remember how many bandages, but it's a lot. Okay, another way of getting out. Out of this pit. Oh, fair. 
Hello? Hello? Do you like scary movies? Why, why, yes, I do like scary movies, as a matter of fact. What's your favorite scary movie? Uh, Evil Dead. I love that film. I like that movie. It was scary. I don't have time to talk, right? Bye. You can get quite a few nice little parts from picking up that charming fellow. Okay. Microphone. There it is. Okay. That's done. I would like to return to this area of the map to collect some more stuff. I figure it would be very useful. Getting the bandages is worth doing, but at the same time, you're going down there, you're risking your life. Is it worth doing, really? Is it worth going out there, down there, to collect everything? In a way, yes. In a way, no. From here, it's a long walk there, but we can get to that boat right over there. Thing is, getting to that boat right over there. I don't want to run. I haven't been been this way. What is down here? It could be a really good route to get to the boat, or there could just be some. Could be nothing at all. That means it's getting late. Yeah, it's late. That means there's going to be a lot more walkers to deal with. In this area. And the axe is running out of durability very quickly. Oh shit. That's not a good sign. Did you see how many there were? Alright. There's so many of them. I want to go that way. That's the way I want to go. I have an idea, but it's dangerous. The chances are those things are going to respawn that, that were just there behind me. Okay, our energy level, if you can see it on the screen, is going down a little bit. This here makes boom. I want to make a boom. I want to get past those things. But... Okay. Ah, oh, there's so many. This is going to be tricky. Thank you all for watching. It's greatly appreciated. I am, unfortunately, out of time right now. This is going to take far longer than I expected. I was really hoping for a quick exit going out that way, and it would be quick if I can get that explosive a bit further in, and then I can blow up the ones that are on the other side of the gate. That'll work. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you're new here, please consider subscribing to the channel. Smash like, boom, like that. <laughs> yeah. Smash like, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell as well to be informed whenever I bring out a new video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.